one. Fuck you too. So, here we are. The adventure is hot. The big question is, is this my story or your story? Let's find out together, shall we? Got that blunt handy? Yo, hope you're up. I would let you sleep yesterday off, but I have some troublesome motherfucker to attend to, and it can't wait. I'm waiting for you at the main square close to my place. Sober up and come see me. Brief you up. Doobie? You know that every trap in the US has this bull? 25 million bucks it costs. Always reminds me of who we are to them. Helps keep me focused. Anyway, listen up. I'm your main and only contact in the cartel. Anything and everything considering the business in and out goes through me. From now on, I'm your daddy, your boss, your fucking wife, all in one person. You need dope? You write to me. You got the cash for the cartel? I take it. You shit your pants? I need to know before you change your underwear. Straightforward. We're gonna start basic. Grass and ant. The three packages waiting for you in a dead drop at the back of the supermarket. Grab them, go home, and get your laptop. Anyway, get to work. Gotta go. We'll get to you later. Just in case you're wondering, dead drops are hidden drop points, where you will retrieve smaller packages. Trash bins, hole in the ground, a big crack in the wall. You oh, now you don't know what I'm talking about? They're usually huh? marked by some kind of symbol, so I'm you should cool. find it pretty easy. Gentlemen, and welcome. I'm Black Operation One, aka Box TV One, and it is finally released Drug Dealer Simulator. Now, I hope you've enjoyed the demo version of it. I know I thoroughly did, and I couldn't wait to get back on. Now it's been released a couple of days, but uh, no, actually, released yesterday, so not even so not even a day. Actually, it's 24 hours, but that scratch that anyway. But yeah. So about the day release, um, and yeah, I just couldn't wait to jump in and get some recording done. So yeah, let's jump to it. So we've met up with Eddie. We got our first task. Uh, tasks are not showing up for some reason. Um, I don't know whether that's just a bug or what. I don't know whether that's intended. I don't know. So uh, so yeah. So let's have a look here, shall we? So of course. Tap for the inventory. We got a bag. Uh, all the stats. Yeah, level one. Organizer. Okay, so retrieve the first merchandise dead drop. Now, if I remember rightly, it's over here. Yeah. Okay. So we don't want to be running too much. We don't want to cause too much there exposure. There it is. Here. See it. Okay. So we have three Gs of MJ and five Gs of. Uh, All right. Now go back home and get to the computer. Your first client should be messaging you any moment now. Okay, you'll so... You'll get notifications on new messages on your phone. But to read them, you'll need the encrypted app on the laptop. Okay, so let's get back home. Back to our grotty apartment, and let's get on that laptop. Let's get on this laptop. Right, let's see what clients we have. Okay. Let's start making this, this dollar. This is ShadyCom. A special, fancy, dark web communicator. This is where you order the merchandise from Eddie. And this is where your clients will contact you. 
It also has other options, but we'll get to that in time. Okay, so our first clients, we have Paul Amador, Adrian Romanos, and Gwendolyn Amador. Okay, some names there. So, hi, I'm looking for MJ, need 3G. How come there's two? That's a misspelling right there. I uh, need three grams, you selling? We are indeed. So, confirm the order. I am looking for AMP. Uh, need 5G, you selling? Yeah. And we need to confirm all these. So, this one's also looking for 3G. J, three grams of MJ. So we have our first orders. Let's go and drop these off. Uh, Shadycom. Through Shadycom, you can order drugs, communicate with clients, choose a person on the contact list, and click the chat input field for options. After confirming orders, the clients will show on the map, find them, and deliver the order the packages. So, as far as I know, you might need that sexy red backpack on the cover. Uh -huh. Beat you to I it, know mate. you're probably used to those sissy casual games where money's stored in a magic cloud under God's fucking pillow, but it ain't the case for us here. You need space to carry cash, so take that into consideration before you run those first clients. Okay, so... I would have thought the first eight levels would be the uh, same as what it was on the demo. Um, maybe some new things have been thrown into it. I'm not too sure, but we'll find out. Um, yo, you've got what I need. Yeah, here it is. So she wants 5Gs of amp. That's the 5Gs of amp sold. Oh, and did I tell you? Backpacks have downsides as well. The bigger the backpack, the slower you run, and more suspicious you may appear to the police. So yeah. Okay, I told you. Now that's your problem. So yeah. So with the backpack stitch. Um. So yeah, with the backpack stitch, I know that it's best not to use your backpack as much. Um, it's best to use your pockets when dealing. Especially when the cops come into play, which are not into play at the moment. We have free roam. But the backpack and running and all this makes you really suspicious to the police. And the more times they stop you or intervene with your business, uh, the more chance you have DEA, so I've heard. Um, and that's back of MJ. Nice. So... Level 2, alright, you've just made your first few sales and made some money. The client should be ordering more soon. Get to the computer to order more dope from Eddie to resupply your stock. Okay, so we need to go back home. Buying some more dope. Okay, so we're home. Let's order some more dope. So we need to click Eddie. Alright, I heard that you made them sales. Well done. Now if you need more drugs, write to me, I'll contact you. So yeah, it's the same principle as in the demo. But if you didn't, uh, if you haven't watched the demo... Uh, basically, Eddie is where you make your orders and you deliver cash to the cartel. So once you basically get your order on tab, and then you got to pay back, which is fair enough. So we're going to buy 10 Gs of MJ and 10 Gs of amphetamine. Okay, so now he will confirm us with how long it's going to possibly be. And then we're going to just have to wait around. So, so approximately 30 minutes. So... Now it says about the waiting or delivery may take some time. It depends most on how large is the package. Remember to always plan this ahead. Eddie will inform you when the package is ready to retrieve. In this meantime, we can either find some other tasks to do or wait. Hit T while and hide it to open the wait dialogue. So yeah, so you've got to wait the time. And uh, yeah, then you've got to go and pick it up from what they call a dead drop. So let's hit the T and let's wait for the time to pass. Okay, so our dead drop's in and we have a couple of orders as well. So we're not going to confirm these orders at the moment. We're going to go and collect these dead drops. So dead drop is... Where's the dead drop? Dead drop. No, no, I was going to say, but it's in old market. Anyway, let's uh, head to old market. Okay, so we're here. Dead drop's going to be behind here. So we get XP for that. Which is nice. Oh, I have an incoming call from Eddie. Yo, I heard the authorities got pissed by that tire fire situation. And they're sending more police on the streets. Watch out for patrols while you run around. They might be nosy. Okay, so this is where the police come into play now. 
Now, going from what I played the demo, because I played that a few times, to be honest with you. I had to run through, which I did for you guys and gals, and then I played it a couple more times just to learn more about it. Uh, okay, that was weird, that's noise. Um, so, on tab, we've got the characters. Now, this here is your risk factor. So, the general risk factor, that will go up the more time you do risky trades, and uh, basically... Yeah, so the more riskier the move, you know, the more riskier the deals are, the more riskier the dead drops, the more risk you've got to take to get earn your money and like sell your dope. That goes up. This here is expulsion, which is the more you're running around, the more you're basically exposing yourself to the authorities. Why do I keep getting this noise for? I don't like getting this donkey noise for, but never mind. Anyway, we have unlocked the. Um, Workstation. So the workstations are furniture-based equipment. Here you can customize drug labs, store labs, and substances meant for mixing and processing. This is also the place where you pack the product to its final weight portions prepared for sale. Hit R. Oh, excuse me. Hit I while at a workstation to view the workstation manual. Well, we don't need any of that. If you do so, want to read any of that, workstation mode now. You can arrange your lab to mix and produce whatever you desire. Remember chemistry classes back in school? <laughs> no? Yeah, me neither. Fuck it. Who cares, right? You'll find more info in the workstation manual. Right, so the workstation manual, we've been over the workstation manual within the demo. If you want to check that out, I will put a link to the demo uh, in this down, down below um, in the description. So check that out if you want to learn more about it. Um, so yeah, so this is where we're going to cut, mix our dope up and uh, baggy it up into, um, you know, into the... Uh, into the weights, preferred weights. And that's what I couldn't, couldn't think of what I was going to say then. So we're going to put our jars down neatly and tidy here. So this is where we can store our dope. Uh, we're going to put the big one up there. Cutting board can go here. Uh, then we've got to place the drugs down. Then we've got to drag the drugs. So we have 10 grams of amphetamine. We're going to mark that as uh, red. And we've got 10 grams of... Uh, marijuana. We're going to mark those green seeds of marijuana. Right, so we are going to need to buy some cutting ingredients. All right, so yeah, okay, I'll get that. I'll get that. I'll get that. I'll get that. So we are going to need to buy some ingredients to cut that down, but first of all, we're going to grab our orders. Uh, we're going to mark, we're going to just double check that one. So uh, we need two grams of ganja here, uh, two grams of speed, and we need another two grams of weed. So we want four grams in total of, uh, of MJ, so we're going to. Activate the uh, workstation again. We're gonna right-click on our um, on our weed, and then we're gonna go package product. And we want two two grams. So we're gonna grab two two gram bags of that. Uh, saving your game. Yep. Yeah, okay. So save is now available. We're not gonna worry about that. Um, have we got the option to go and buy now? Uh, yes. Yeah, so we've got our option to buy. Um, so we're gonna leg it. We're gonna leg it out until we go to gas station. Uh, we are gonna drop this weed off at the same time. Now, did you want weed? Yeah, he did. Okay, so we're gonna hopefully drop off this uh, MJ at the same time. I don't remember who wanted what, so you know she wanted. So something wrong, so we won't forget. Be right back. Uh, yeah, you can jump fence as well, which is great ideal for when you're getting chased by the police. Uh, yeah, he is. Okay, so we sold our MJ. Got a few more XP there. So we've hit max XP within this area. This uh, town is broken down by... Oh, shit, I've run away. This town is broken down by areas. Um, which we have to try and take control of. Can't get in there at the moment. Hopefully we'll unlock that soon, which I'm sure we will. Oh, Amy Schrader. Oh, I hear the popo. Well, we have no dope on us, so we should be alright. Um, we are going to buy... So we need to buy sugar. But we're going to buy... Two packs of bacon soda. And we're going to buy one pack of ibuprofen. And we're going to buy one box of sugar. Uh, Total fancy. And we need a couple of these spray cans as well. So we can grab them. Um, except. 
case. We have, like I said, we have the dope, so we ain't got to worry about it. But we got to work out where we get the mill from. Because it didn't give us the option for the mill. we got to watch out for the police here. Now you can lean left and right, so you can peek around walls. When we know where it is, we're just going to sneak around this box. We're going to run, make no noise. Now, I've done a little bit of reading up, like I said, and a bit of testing. Now, like in, um, on the demo version stuff. Now, I've done a bit of reading up. I know some mixtures, which we're going to try. Um, there's supposed to be a woman here, because you can buy, so you can buy the mortal, mort, mortar. But I don't think we can unlock a mortar yet, so. Now that's an interesting place. Look up. The two towers, they call it. Creme de la creme of the native pathology. Now, there ain't no Saruman here, but there sure is a lot of magic going on, if you know what I mean. <sighs> okay, so... Yeah, that's Twin Towers. I don't know if we can access that eventually. We could never do anything with that in um, demo version. So we can't cut the pills at the moment, or use the sugar. Sorry, we can't use the pills or the sugar, because we need that uh, mortar. So, we can use the baking soda. Let's whack our peels. Let's turn the peels like that. Make them look nice. Same as our sugar. Like that. Right, so. Do we have... We don't even have any equipment, man. Okay. Don't have no equipment, so. So, we're going to take the 10 Gs of Femin. Now, we want... We want three grams of bar bicarb or baking soda. I do apologise. Um, apply mix, a new amphetamine mix. We're going to call this amp uh, mix one, just so we know that our first initial mix was ten Gs of amp and three Gs of. Um, baking soda, so if this doesn't work out, we know we can change it up. So we did lose some just because of of what we're mixing it on. Now hopefully better equipment will give us more precision, um, less work time, and maybe less processing loss. Okay, so we need 2Gs of this package product. Grab 2Gs of this to see how well this stuff sells. Hopefully we don't get no complaints. Um, if I remember rightly, she was around here when she there. No, she's don't want to do too much running. Like I said, we really need to get rid of our bag as well. But we got the spray paint on this moment. Oh, did I do two? What did I do two? Oh crud! I didn't mean to do two. Oh, I can't remember clicking two, but yeah, okay. I'm only clicking two grams, not two bags. All right. Now that's right because we can always drop us off. It always comes in handy. So we can just just place that there. We can. Always pick it up with F, as you can see there. That see back in our um, our bag there. So we do, like I said, we do really want to get rid of this bag. So we're going to take that. We're going to put our cash in there, like so. So let's see if there's any more clients. Uh, we have unlocked East Old Town. Uh, next place is Old Market place, which is locked. To unlock it, we need a minimum respect of 700 and a minimal dealer level of four. Okay, now we can up the prices here. I don't know if we're able to do this at this precise moment in time. No, we cannot. We've got to improve our sales and all this. Um, so now we sh should learn about... Yeah, so you got that. So we've got to choose the tags. So you've got to buy spray paint and place four wall markings. Hence why I bought that spray paint. Uh, I feel like having a radiation sign. Why not? Okay, so we are going to need bag. I don't understand why we cannot take it in our pockets, but... Okay, so let's head to... Where do we unlock? Uh, East Old Town, that's it. We're going to go and mark up the territory. Then we're going to start giving away some free samples. Okay, so that's the tags done. And that should have clicked that off, yeah. So the uh, task we have to do, find a potential client and have him a free drug sample, which is the next thing we need to do. Unlock East Old Town Market, return to your debt to Eddie to make uh, 
when you make some money off your sales. So whilst we're here, we do have five skill points. Now the first thing I I wouldn't recommend, well I would recommend, because you need as much money as experience as possible, is whacking it in these bottom two. Don't spend too much, obviously, but the more in here, the quicker you're going to level up, the quicker you're going to make money. Oh, excuse me. Scenes, this game's all about selling the dope, making a dollar. I, I, I personally recommend using them. So as you can see, you've got some people here with question marks. Uh, we need to give them some free samples. So let's, uh, let's go and drop the spray cans off, our backpack off, and let's get some free samples out on the go here. So back down there. So we don't want to do two Gs. Um, let's cut, because we cut this stuff. Not cut. Um, let's baggy up, sorry. Let's baggy up five one gram um, baggies there. Let's just see if we have any more orders as well. We can do them on our way. We do. We have two orders. Uh, so this one wants two grams of speed and two grams of fat. So we need that bag and we need uh, one more two gram bag of amphetamine. And we have another ding dong. Please don't be unfamiliar. Ganja. Right, so we need a baggie of. Uh, two gram baggie of MJ as well. Two gram baggie. No, I don't want two. No, 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 no. One. Thank you. Inventory is full. Ah, oh, shocking. Obviously. 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 I forgot about we got the three samples. Okay, let's go and do these first. We'll come back. Do runs. So, I'll find the best. Get some orders. Get some free samples. Um, do one complete like loop, dropping all those orders off, gathering the money, giving your free samples out, and then make it back, cut up, etc. etc. Um, at least then you're not spending as much time out uh, around the fuzz. So keeping your exposure down. It is higher risk, obviously, because you're carrying a lot of dope and a lot of dollar around. On these runs, depending on, of course, how much. Uh, cash return, deliver a free sample. Um, let's go and do. Let's go and drop our last. Our last two grams of amp off. Let's drop the speed off. It's got Popo up there, but luckily we're going to go behind here. Should be behind here. Yeah, there you go. Hello, Adrian. Right, so. That's two G's. We got a dollar, so now we got a dollar. We can go back home. Actually, no, let's let's not, let's not, let's not, let's not play like that. Let's do what I, I like to do, which is loop it. I was gonna go back, drop the bag off. Uh, looks like it's coming in. Yeah, it's starting to get night time in a minute. That's when the real fun starts. Hello, my friend. Want the free sample? Oh. No. As a bit racist, I didn't realise it was Chinese. Okay. Uh, yeah, that was, that, was, that was just uh, pure coincidence. Race level three. Yeah, that was just pure coincidence. So, do apologise for that. Let's drop a cash off. We could do have more free samples. We're just going to keep in our pocket. Because um, I find, like, like on the... Um, Demo find as you're running around or walking around, you always end up seeing uh, more more uh, potential clients that want um, some free samples. So it's always best to carry a couple of bags, one gram bags around with you. Now this is where we're going to run a problem. So he wants two G's of fat. Now we could give him two free samples because we only got 1.9 left. So what we could do is we could baggy this last lot up. Baggy this last lot up. Okay, so when we got a little bit like that, we how come we can't baggy up that? You know, it's just, just you just can't do it. In reality, yes, you probably would and just sell it on as a one G or just below, but or you'll add an extra bit of cut. But there's nothing you really do about that. So we're gonna have to dump these contents because we can't add anything else into there. You could probably chuck it in the next load, but then that mixes the ratios up, and then it all gets. A bit. August a little bit uh, confuddling and a bit 
with it at hand then. So, two G's effects, we can give in two one gram bags. Um, how much dollar do we have? I'm going to chuck it under there. How much dollar do we actually have? 159. So, whilst we're, on, whilst we're doing this deal, let's see how much Eddie needs for the dope. So, we're going to come here. We're going to deliver cash for cartel. We're just going to message back how much. So, 120. So, we owe Eddie 120. So, we're going to go like that. And we're going to go... We're going to take 110. Because we're going to get some from this deal anyway. So let's yeah, let's uh, go and do the sale and go and pay Eddie off. Well, I see our client, and this is why really it's best not to have a bag. Oh crap! Across the road. Units, right, we're gonna cemetery. back up, back up, get up. Once we go around that corner. Thank you very much. Right. So, uh, yeah, you go, my friend. So you want two, two of them. No, we should have enough because we just got twenty-four dollar. As you can see, our respect for East Hill Town's going up. More respect here. The sooner we can unlock the next area. So, yeah, here it is, my friend. 120. Nice. So now we paid Eddie off, which means we can go and buy some more dope. So let's... Before it comes in night time, because that's when the sales will really... Yeah. See that? See this guy here? Look? He wants a free sample. Come here. Have a free present for you, my friend. Free sample. There you go. I think that's the same guy. But it kind of can't be because we have that client. I think it's just random NPCs, isn't it? Ran it's randomized things. So, let's drop cash off here. And let's check our clientele. So, 2Gs of Ganja. Confirm order. We have 60 minutes now until curfew. And then that's when we need to get our clientele in. So we're, we're going to make a new order. Our limit goes up each time, so we have 160 now. Uh, we still. Yeah, we still can't. Uh, still can't buy more than that. But. It's so hard to talk with their. Uh... Okay, so we need two two G's of uh, MJ. Oh, we should have another client. This one starts getting a little bit hectic. Okay, no, it wasn't. It was Eddie Lens. Now we have thirty minutes. Okay, so we need. So this is gonna be the last of our marijuana. No, we want two bags. Thank you. Let's go in. Uh, has another uh, another um, message on the computer, on the laptop. So let's drop these off. One. If you look down the bottom on the, you've got like a little radar -y thing there. It will show you which direction the clients go in, so you don't always have to look at your map. Oh crud! Five zero. -oh. That train is so loud. So yeah, in, in when it when it hits the uh, curfew or the police uh, state, uh, the police are a lot harder to deal with. So the more your exposure during the day, the more police at night. Hello, my friend. Hello. Right. So two Gs. There you go, my friend. Enjoy. We have another client over here, potential client over here. Hello. I uh, have a free B. So as you can see, we are now running out of our free samples. We have one. Oh, the 5 O's there. We're going to cut through the alleyway. So you've always got to keep a lookout for the 5 0. Um, as right, so when I was messing around on the free sample or the. Whoa, don't stop me, don't stop me. Or on the uh, demo. How many times I've ran around the corner and just bumped face to face with the 5 -0. And you got like, you know, a bag full of dope. It's a bit, uh, a bit shocking. Alright, so let's come in here, drop a cash off, and then we're going to wait time until the dead drop is ready to collect. Then we're going to do some more cutting up. Okay, so dead drop's ready. And it's just literally down the road. We are going to save it um, just before the police hours start, or the police state, as I call it. 
before that timer starts. Now it runs from 9 to 6, I think it is, something like that. So if you can have a look around, look, you've got markings. It explains about this at the beginning, but you have markings over some things. And this is where your dead drop's going to be, but there's all sorts of places it can be. Literally, as they say, it could be cracks, it could be vents, it could be anything. It could be back in cars, anything. So let's go back, cut this up, get ready for the nighttime rush. We ain't going to take no more orders until we get nighttime. And I will explain why in a second. Um, no, no, one, that one, that one, that one there, that one there. And then we want to drag this one to there. So we want that one in there. Uh, MJ goes in there, green, lovely. And then we want three grams of soda. Apply mix, new amphet mix, shit. So I, I can change, I can change it when I put it in there anyway. Um, so police hours are started. Get on, motherfucker. Bedtime. During police hours, you should remain home. But we, the bad guys, <laughs> we don't give a fuck. The police do, though. So you keep an eye on them and better stick to the shadows. Okay, so that siren's new. I can't remember there being the siren in the demo. It might have been, but I can't remember it. So that's new. Um, so yeah, we're going to wait. I know we do have a client, but we are going to wait. Um, because within this time, uh, it's double payout and double XP. Within these times, it's double payout and double XP. Just because the principal fact, because like I said, the police are a lot harder. There's like double the uh, quantity of patrols. Um, and of course, the more higher your exposure factor during the day, the more police at night time. Um, I don't know how hard they get, but we will experience as we go on. So, or we just have another client. So we have six points again. Like I said, I'm going to spend them in the top, on the bottom too, so we can get even more money. Um, I think it makes only two clients. Uh, two clients. Let's see if we can just skip time a little bit. It's three. You get the police outside. See if we can get a couple more. We got plenty of time. Plenty of time. If you don't click the clients or accept the uh, the trade or the deal, the clients don't. Yeah, they don't. They don't disappear or anything or change of mind. It's four. Um, okay, we ain't gonna, I don't think we're gonna hit, we might hit all five, might get the other one when we go. Oh, he's already got, what, two grams of ammo. Okay, well, apparently, okay, so, apparently we've already read this one, so, that's fine. So we have all these clients, so we're gonna confirm order, confirm order, confirm order, confirm order, and confirm. Now, I know I didn't read them all, um, which is fine. Because it, once we come over to here to bag him up, it would tell us on the left. So, deliver two grams of amphetamine to Paul, deliver four grams of marijuana to Leon, deliver two grams of amphet to Charlie, to deliver two grams of amphet to Gwendo Gwendolyn, deliver two grams of amphet to Adrian. So, we want one, two, three, four bags of uh, 2G amps and one bag of 4G marijuana. So, let's do the MJ first. We want two. Now, why did... No, 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 no. I'd never click three. One, two. Two G bags of MJ. And we want... One, two, three, four... Of these. Like that. That should be correct. And now we go out... And make the cell. So we are... Like I said, I did say we are going to save it. So we are going to save it here. Start from the top, save slot, much easier. So as you can see, they're all dotted here, they're never end. Now we've got to definitely be on our toes. So we're going to do this one over here first because there's only one. Pulls over here. So we're going to go from here. So we're going to do a loop. We're going to go from here, around, and around, back up. Okay. And you want one bag of amp. Uh, you want a bag of amphet. bag of amphetamine. Uh, you want the four G's of MJ. Cut through here. So she looks like she's in the garages. Or the garages. Uh, sorry, he. Not she. Hi, he. I apologize. Uh, 
Last bag of amp. We go home. Drop all the cash off, see how much cash we have. Now the sooner we pay Eddie off, the better. And we start stockpiling this dope then. <coughs> so again, we have two hundred we've got two hundred and thirty six dollar from that, which is nice. Um how much amp do we have with four grams of amp, six grams of MJ, so we might be able to get some more clientele. Um but again we're gonna have to wait. Okay, so we have some more clients, or some more, not clients, sorry, some more orders coming. So we have one, two, three, four. Um, so we need some MJ. Now this is where we're going to struggle now. So as you can see, three of them want MJ. Four grams of MJ to be exact. And one wants four grams of amp. Now, we've got four grams of amp, that's fine, but we've only got six grams of MJ. So what we're going to do... So we are going to bag up this last two grams of amp. And again, we're going to have to dump it. So we hit the dump button, dump that. Excuse me. Um, let's confirm the order on that one. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to take a trip. We're going to pay off Eddie and then come back and make a new order. So we can make a new order first. So if we... So if we... we with our last order... We used 140 from 160. Um, so, if, no, it was 120 from 140, sorry. Um, but as you can see, well, we only had 20 bucks left limit, uh, but we have now a 40 bucks limit. As you can see, it's gone up by 20. Um, that's just because of, I think that's because of the XP. Um, so, the more times, of course, we deal with Eddie, obviously, the larger that number is going to go up. And the more we can order. So let's go deliver cash to Cartel. He's going to let us know. We'll pay them off. So it's 120. So we're going to grab from here. We're going to grab. So let's grab. Let's grab 90. Because we should make the rest from sale. From selling this amp. So yeah. Let's go and sell this amp. And uh, go and pay the off. Get a new drop. Uh, another uh, dead drop in. Another, another uh, a load of dope. Okay, so we're here with Charlie and we're about to drop the amp off. Thank you very much. 68, which is plenty. Bank money. Uh, you can keep some of your money in your bank account. There are a few ATMs in the ghetto where you can withdraw or deposit cash. You will need bank account money for furniture shopping and hideout renting. Okay. So now we're going to be learning about the ATM system. Okay, it's just gonna. Okay, I thought it would let us know about the ATM systems. Oh, it is. So we have to check out an ATM. So, right. So, yeah, here's your here's your money, mate. Uh, before we do the ATM, we are going to uh, play through the police hours or the police state, as I like to call it, because um, it's just easier to get to the ATMs. Because the ATMs are dotted around, but you have one by supermarket, one by French store. Um, I don't think we can get to that one. I think that's the only one we can get to at the moment. Um, but I would like it. I would, I would like to not worry. About it. Looking over my shoulder and checking every corner to make sure five are in there. So we're going to make a new order from Eddie. So we have 160 limit this time. So we're going to whack in 10, 10. So that's 120. So let's do at least 40. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. It should should cover us. I was just I was just debating whether do we need more amp, but we do. We just use the last four, but that's fine. So we're at two eight seven. So we are slowly getting bank. We are slowly getting bank. Um, four G speed. We can't do. We have thirty minutes to wait. Um, so let's get one of these. One of these ganja deals done. So we need a. Two bag of two gram. Uh, he's down here in the in the construction slash work area. The uh, what the warehouses and all that are over here in the industrial area. That's the word I was thinking of. Trying trying to think of industrial industrial zone. 
No racism towards white people allowed. No racism at all would be nice. Uh, you're finally here. Get the stuff. Yeah, it's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. Thank you very much. So, 60 bucks right there. And that gives us a level 4. We've got 108 respect in West Oak Town. Uh, West Oak Town. That's where we are. See, if you notice... Oh, five Because we haven't done many deals within West Oak Town. Um, our XP's gone down. Um, which is expected, but then of course that will eventually go up. So we're six bucks. That's all to our sales at the moment, um, because we're selling dope from our last deal. Uh, we've also got the chance to unlock old marketplace. Nice. So we've reached a minimum um, respect to 700 east of town. So we're gonna unlock that. So again, we're gonna take this time. We're gonna take spray can. Um, do we have? So we do have two grams of MJ, so we're going to grab two one gram bags to finish that off. So that's all fresh. And we're going to go over there. See if we can get some new clientele in. Enough spray cans. I think one does two. Oh, one does one, apparently. But I only bought two cans, so. So that didn't really make sense, did it? No, right. So, that drug. Drug package is always back there, so we can we can visit the ATM here. We might as well. I know what we're gonna okay, do yet, but we might as well check it out. Carefully, the bank account is the place to keep your legal money. You can use ATMs to withdraw or deposit cash, but be careful, huh? And keep in mind that you're an immigrant, get a low life. Too much unregistered money flowing through that account may lure interest of the state, and that, my friend, is asking for trouble. Okay, so yeah, so this is a place where we can, as they said, keep our legal oh, money. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, fine. Also, avoid getting into debt. First of all, you'll need that account for some payments, and second of all, the state dislikes criminals, but it sure hates debtors. Yep, yeah, just like reality, just like reality. Then, so yeah, so with the ATMs, like I said, you can store, you can put your cash in there, and uh, it basically turns it to legit cash. Which is good, and that cash is useful for things like this. So furniture stores, because um, that is the furniture store, isn't it? Yeah, furniture store. Um, I don't know whether you can use supermarkets. So Shame to be able to use a police station, isn't it? A gas station. You can no, you don't use. You yeah, no, you use uh, your dope cash. And of course, we don't know about this lot at the moment. So, um, so yeah. Um, so we need to find a way of getting our lab equipment up and running now. I don't know when, whether we have to unlock that, whether it's a certain level. But on the demo, you start with some lab equipment. Which I'm sure that's because it's the demo. And when you're experiencing not too much, but as much as you possibly can. Um, just listen now for the 5-0. That dead drops around here. So we've got to look for that symbol. That gives a rough estimate of where it is. And I think it's in there. Yep. So I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna lug across the street here into our into our gritty grotty apartment. Can't wait to upgrade this. Really can't wait to get a bigger bigger place. Really bigger place. Okay, so we don't want that one, we don't want that one. We didn't see actually I didn't see oh no. I wonder if okay, no, it's fine. I just didn't see no um People want people I can give free samples to. So 10 G's of that, and then again 3 G's of this. So we always want to mix it the same. Um, apply mix. Uh, what do I want to name this? What was it? Uh, I can't remember what bloody I made the name this one. Your amp mix one. I can't remember what I named it now. That'll do. Uh, drag that there. Green again. Wait for this to do. Drag it to there. Uh, red, right. So now we have some dope. Okay. Uh, what is the time? Three. So we we'll probably have a couple of hours of police state left. We've only got two clients. So this one wants four G's of grass, uh, four G's of speed, uh, another four G's of grass there. Okay. So we need we need uh, four. God, I'm full of wind today. Four bags of two grams. 
you could do three and one, but just easier to cut it like that. And we need a full bag of amp as well. Do we have anything? Uh, we have our two free samples. We have our free samples as well, which I'm going to wipe in there so it doesn't get too confusing. Usually the clientele's mix around sometimes they're in the same space. Um, same spot. Sorry, not space, spot. Uh, four grams. Okay, so we want a uh, drop quantity. Did I only get two? Oh, it's. No, 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 no. We want. It was one for amp and the rest for. Here we go. Near the police. Let's take a shortcut. There you go, my dear. Right. And pulled over here. I know I said not to do too much running around, but in the police hours, it doesn't really matter. As you can see, yeah, exposure factor doesn't go up during police hours, which is nice. And where is this one? Where's, she? where's he? Sorry, where's he? There he is. Um, four grams of that. Thank you very much. So again, as you can see, I went so. Started here, I went around there, went around, the police circle, back on. I can't wait to see where this game's going to take us to, honestly, where the developers take this game. It's got so much potential, so much potential. Like I say, like I said, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. I really do enjoy this game. It's really good. I like simulation games as it is. Uh, 2Gs of amp, 2Gs of amp. Do we have that 4G? Oh, crud. Didn't mean to do that. Oops. Uh, put you back down there. Thank you very much. Uh, we have how much? Yeah, so we need two more bags of 2G. And that come to here. Let's confirm the orders. A lot of it is basically back and forth, back and forth. Um, we also want to deliver the cash to the cartel. Okay, so let's find out how much we need. It's about 120, 140. Yeah, 120 again. Um, we might make it off this, but going to take 90 oh, let's take 84 bugger it take 84 okay so again we can loop around and come to go to Adrian first and then around uh, no 50 don't see any don't hear any not that I can really hear over those blood that bloody train um Adrian should be around here somewhere. I'm looking on the radar. There he is. Or oh, she is. I don't know if he has a heat in it. They stay in age. Could be both. Could be both. So we have enough to pay Eddie as well. We're going to do that first. Oh, okay. Okay. Where are they? <gasps> okay. So we're going to loop around. We don't want to go that way. Okay, don't you dare see me. Hello, Eddie, mate. Uh, there's your cash. Thank you very much. Client's right there as well. Okay, let's leg it down there, leg it down there. Leg it down! <laughs> Jump up the fence. Have a peek, they're gone. So, this is all our cash. Oh, all our cash now. Yeah, all our cash now. And he's had all our dope now. Oh, it is all our dope. Police can hear is at the border there. There's no police around here. Should be right to run through here and in, in. Safe and sound. So we're gonna check see how long this uh, the police hours are full. So we yeah, have got got about an hour. In game hour. Uh just enough time to do probably one more one more pickup. Making an order, as you see it's gone up to two twenty now. This is what I'm saying. The more you use Eddie, the more you buy, and the quicker you you pay for it, uh, the more money you get. So we should, should, might be able to get 20 Gs of each. 170, 140, no, we can't. But, because we can cut hemp, we're going to get more weed than we are amphetamine. Uh, we can check our bank from here. Yes, okay, thank you for letting me know. So we have $850 in the bank. Um... 
I haven't. We haven't learned about bitcoins yep, at the moment. Cryptocurrency. Oh, this right. is how you pay for the good stuff here, illegal stuff. You can buy cryptocurrency from certain shady vendors. In theory, it's been delegalized by the U.S. a few years back, but yeah. Okay, so that's a little bit. I don't know where you buy those bitcoins from, but I'm sure we will learn. I'm sure we will learn. So shady vendors. So it's obviously from like uh, I don't know, folks walking around. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Uh, so we've got to wait 45 minutes, Freddy. And we have no more clientele, so we're just going to drop the remainder of our cash off. So we're over 500 now, and we're going to wait. Okay, so the dead drop is ready. Also, I had a lot of pingy ping pings. We have two more clients with so two G's of grass, four G's of grass, uh, and okay. And another one just popped up. So two G's, two G's, four G's. We have some from Old Market coming. I don't know why. We haven't gave. Oh, we haven't even got two Ds of grass. We haven't really given three free samples over there. We do need to go over there and get some free samples. Might actually do that quickly now. Oh no! Oh, come now. We didn't, um, I can have a quick look, I suppose. But I think it's better to do it during the day because they just wander around, obviously. So we do not want to get. Busted by the five of them. It's fun, but it could also be painful. It could be painful. Right, so now we've done that. Let's drop the ten in there. Um drop that in there. So what do we need? Let's, let's accept these accept these orders and then we know exactly what we need. So two G's, four G's. Two two G's, three two G's. We need three, two grams of MJ and one four gram of MJ. Okay, so package product. So we do have. So that's going to be one two three four five. So we need four, four two grams, five two grams. So that's. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, a four, a four and three twos, a four, three twos, yeah, that's correct. We have also another couple of orders just come in, uh, another two G's of weed and four, another four G's of weed, Jesus, okay, so we need another three bags of two. Everyone wants weed tonight. Another three bags two. Okay. See if we can go and quickly do this before police hours to get that double money and double XP. And uh, we have one right behind us. We are gonna have to run through this as quick as possible. Uh two G's. Cause it is getting very close to morning now. Birds are chirping. Uh, so f yeah, for two G's, that we are getting forty dollar a time. Reach level five, that's nice. I am looking around as well, obviously, and listening out for police calls and police presence. We do not want to get busted whilst rushing around here. We also want to kind of drain all our stamina as well, because if we do get caught, we need to outrun them. Uh, let's at least do a couple more, please. Hello, Adrian. And uh, you want four. Jeez. You're there, hidden. Nice. Done. Noise. Oh, crap. Uh, what's our tasks, anyway? Gain a dealer from satisfy. Oh, we can get dealers now. Nice. Unlock new areas, stinking kennel. Ooh, what bloody names. Um, so we're just going to stand here, we're just going to whack, we're going to put some more on the pockets and some more on the salesman, so now, oh, now we've got three pockets, nice. So we should, in theory, if we weren't going around with our freebies, previous samples, we could in theory do without the bag. Maybe do one or two deals at a time, 
we could do without a bag. So please have us lifted. So that was that was close. That was close. Very close. Okay, so now it doesn't matter if we get caught with... Well, it matters if we get caught with dope, but I mean, it matters if we get caught with no dope on us. Um, yes, yeah, so we can get rid of our bag now. I'm going to also... Actually, I'm going to put that down. I'm going to keep the weed on me. Um, as a free sample. And I'm also, ladies and gentlemen, I think that is going to be it for this first episode. Um, we've done 24 hours in-game 24 hours. And yeah, it's been fun. It's been fun. There's a lot of going over of what was in the demo, but we've learned some new things and we got some new tasks. And yeah, it's 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 just going to get a better. Quiet, please. Quiet, quiet, please. I'm saying goodbye to the lovely people. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed. If you have, remember to smash that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, you know, make sure you please subscribe and share the channel out. Let's reach this 1,000 for the end of the month. That, that is my main goal. This month is to reach the thousand subscribe mark. That would be would be much appreciated. Um, so yeah, so thank you for watching uh, Drug Dealer Simulator episode one. Um, hopefully you tune in for the next one. And so yeah, thank you again, ladies and gentlemen. Remember to have fun, keep gaming, and I'll see you then. Uh, goodbye.